Hey guys, Bryself here, and welcome back to Illusion of Gaia. Apparently Ishtar lives with monsters. Also, he can put his arm back on and you can't, so play safe. So, uh, let's see what we got here. Alright, we got skeletons, and oh, I kicked that bat in the face. That was amazing. That was holy amazeballs. Alright, uh, looks like we're gonna do a bunch of up and down here to kill all the monsters that are in existence here. Oh, you got freaking punted bad. Love it. Love it. Hate it. Alright. Oh, you're going nowhere, Sunny Bucko Jim. Hey, 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 Mr. Bat. Yeah. Alright, the bats aren't so bad. They're just kind of obnoxious because they're off in the wilderness here. Kind of making you work for it. But if you do the lunge attack, it seems to take them out pretty nicely. Oh, that bat. How did you avoid that? The bat took it, but you somehow were like, Nah, I'm good, brah. <laughs> Man, that was, like, perhaps the easiest power-up we've had in a while. That was kind of crazy. Hopefully not too many jewels to be found around these parts. Yeah. You gotta love that attack power being up. Alright, let's check out these rooms, because they all seem to go up or down and have some fun times for us. Hey, don't, don't, don't run. Just don't. So this probably goes up to that other one? Yes, it does. Alright. Good. Good. Let's go down here and see what's up. Well, there's a bat waiting to get murdered. That's something. Whoa, bat. Darn it. That slide booting is really not effective on the bats. Oh, you're cornered, son. Did he actually hit? Whoa. That was like three whole things of, like, life gone. My God. Don't let them attack you. What did he even do? He, did he punch me? I don't know. It didn't really... wasn't too apparent to me what he did. Okay. Right. That thing's kind of freaky, man. I'm not even going to pretend to lie about that. Alright, let's get out of here. We'll let uh, Long Neck McGee have his fun. This brings us down here, and we'll have to murder some bats. Sounds like a plan. Alright, good. Whoa, what the hell? Okay. So Jesus Christ almighty, man. Good thing I can block that or I was dead as hell. I don't know about this thing, if it's going to reach me or not, but jeez, I'm... Oh, I needed that in the worst way possible. Got my ass beat, like, that can't be right. I'm probably not supposed to be here yet. Man, oh man, though. Talk about getting your face punched in. My God. That did not go well for me. At all. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, I forgot my jewel. Oh, well. Those skeletons are dangerous, man. Looks like my slide booting attack is kind of dangerous to depend on down here. Oh, that was so needed. My god, that one skeleton just beat me, though. He beat me like a redheaded stepchild. My god. He was brooking none of my crap. He was just on board. Man, that was vicious Aloysius. Oh, bat. Oh, oh god. Oh god, there's bats everywhere. I've really screwed the pooch here. I've taken the pooch and I've thoroughly screwed it. And that is not a good thing. I'm not about the pooch screwing. Yeah, there you go. The slide got me right into his range again, so that's something. Yeah, I knew there'd be one right there. That's just the type of malarkey they would do. Oh, well. That's it? Okay. Sure, I'll take more attack power. More strength has never been so wanted or required, honestly. We have seven enemies in here. And they want to be taught lessons. Possibly in respect. But they're not in here. Oh, this is the torch clue. Okay, there's a torch left, a torch right, and a torch right. So I want to, like, probably psycho dash this wall right here. No, that didn't seem to do it. Maybe it's the one where they both point the same way. So, like, here? Okay, no. How about here? Okie dokie. Do I just have to hit them? Okay. So, you teach me that this thing can bust holes in walls, but I don't need it for this. That makes perfect sense, game. Thanks for playing. Okay, that thing's kind of scary. Oh, yeah, and I got a hit point up out of him, too. Very nice. That turdy looking mug. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He is super aggressive when he gets going. You gotta not give them the time, apparently. The time of day is not theirs to be had. You guys do anything? Oh, you do something kind of scary, I guess. 
There you go. Give me my defense. Excellent. Um, can I slide through this? Uh, no? No, I- yes, I can! Ooh! And, good thing I did! There was a red- alright, there's a red jewel there to be had. Well, that's good to know about. Whoa, wind tunnel, that's right. Can I use- I can use the boot to slide, this is good. So I'm gonna be doing that as much as possible. I'm just gonna slide if they spit at me, too. Wow, just two enemies. That is a freebie and a half. And it even refills me for my transgressions versus that Skellington. Get up there. He's moonwalking. He's moonwalking. Man, this place is just fast as the dickens. I'm not complaining. I'm just kind of surprised. That's all. Haha. <laughs> Get back here. You're dead. Give me your jewel. Dead. Dead. Mm -mm -mm. Drinking up. Whoa. 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 Well, killed two out of three in one go. That's something. Yeah, no. Okay, let's just get rid of that guy, because this guy's not near as scary. And we get defense up. Nice. Nice. This is a very strange dungeon, this place. Um... Uh... This is the clue about hearing the waterfall, probably. Alright, it appears probably here, judging by how loud it is. Yeah! Very nice. Very nice. Let's see what's going on. There's nothing over here? Alright, sure. Well, let's go this way and see what we can find and enjoy ourselves and be all happy in the pantsy. Alright. Kind of looks like Princess Jasmine just a little bit. It's kind of weird. And that's Kara, apparently. She's con- How does Will know she's contained inside the picture? Is he, like, an art expert? Jesus Christ, Will, really? Alright. Ooh, nice. Nice, and the second red jewel. Uh, looks like I'm gonna have to go in here, so this is probably where that Ishtar guy is. That is not well drawn, that sprite. Um, sure. Go into this room, yeah. Well, neat. Thanks, buddy. I shouldn't have to play a game to do it. Alright. A voice. Learn well the condition of that room. And then you learn to leave the room. Alright, so we got like a blue pot, and a red pot, and a red pot, and a chair, and a table, and books, and pottery on there and there's two windows. Okay. Show what's different from the room before. Okay, it's right here. The jar has changed color. Nice! Alright, so we're playing a game of, uh, what's the difference, really? Alright, Ishtar's voice, okay. The condition of the room. Alright, we got kind of like a green, or a gray on the left, let's call it green. Green picture on the left, and then you got the blue on the right, and you got two red pots in the corner. Okie dokie. Well, that's easy. The pots have changed color. Cool. Alright, let's go in here. Learn well the condition of that room. Okay. You know, guys, just to be safe, I should probably check in the chest to make sure there's nothing crazy. All right, cool. There's an herb in the in the chest. Excellent. Let's go in here. This looks identical. Cause there was a rock in the corner and the two statues. Uh, the chest, I guess, because I stole the herb. How about the contents of the jewel box changed? Well, because I stole something. Or there's a red jewel. How are you supposed to know that? Uh, even even with me stealing the herb next door, uh, that but that does but th <sighs> this game sometimes. All right, what do we got here? Okay, the condition of the room. You've learned it. Leave the room. All right, there's statues and there's like the Mother Mary and there's a rock in the corner and then that's it. There's no other features. So this 
thus seems kind of weird to be a last second room. Okay. Different than before. Well, there's two statues, the Mother Mary and a rock. So nothing has changed. Oh, I see it. Do you guys, if you haven't played this before, do you, do you, do you realize what the difference is? His sprite is like different. It's like wind is blowing his hair or whatever, you know, like, like it doesn't, there's a secret. It's, it's doing that. It wasn't doing that on the other room. <laughs> exactly. The wind blew your hair around. <laughs> That's actually kind of a neat trick. I like that one, but the chest one was bull crap. Not a hard test though, to say the least. So hopefully I get to punch his face in here with my uh, flute sword now. My floored, as it likes to be called. That's not what it's called. He looks like a Civ 2 advisor. Hey, buddy. Yes, you have? Uh, I really don't want to make out with art. Okay. Soon you'll become a paint, but... Uh, yeah. But... Wait, why would... Like, did he just commit suicide by paintbrush? That's a new one. Anyway... We found magic dust. Okie dokie then. Okie dokie smokey. This is a, another one of those weird chunks of this game, to put it lightly. Alright, Kara, what's going on, baby? Ah, uh, daddy's coming, even though I don't want to be your daddy at all, but you know. Alright. Oh, I bet you he wants to spread something on Kara. <laughs> Never mind. Aw, he gently kissed it. And the painting's gone? Oh, there she is. Hi, Kara. Unless you're some kind of weird zombie, Kara. Um, okay. You make me so mad? Yeah, it's true, you're not. <laughs> just, you should have fed her to Riverson, I'm just saying. I son of a bitch, I don't know what I'm doing myself, son of a bitch. Okay. Yes, you were. No, you can't. You really can't. Hmm. That doesn't make any sense. Dude, it's good. Because I'd have to have brain damage for that to make sense. Yeah, I'd never forget to turn into a painting either, if you want to be honest. That's, uh, that's a hell of a thing to have happen. It's a hell of a thing, man. It's a hell of a thing. Where are you now? Oh, where are you now? Because she's dumb as hell. She doesn't. Yes, that's true. My man already put me in my place. Ah. Apologies mean more when you exclamate them. We should forgive her. Wait, what floating city? Tell me when you're ready. All right. Hey, Eric. Have anything enlightening to say? Well, that's good they clue you in to go look for one. Hmm. Wait, does that mean I should go look now? Oh, neat. I mean, I got three from the dungeon and one from there. Could there possibly be a fifth one? Uh, crud. Am I actually going to have to go double check everything over there? Because I think I checked everything. Well... I guess I'm gonna have to. Well, that was a big old bust. I didn't find anything, so hopefully I'm not missing anything. Let's just get out of here. <laughs> yeah, wait a minute, Neil. It's on the water. It might be muggy, but it shouldn't be hot. Unless it's like... And, well, I'm assuming it's the water. What if it's just in the sky? Who knows at this game? Where are we going? Um... Why? Why would you turn? Oh, the traveling in this on the map. Oh my! Oh my God! Ugh! Close enough for? Oh my God! It's close enough for government work. Stop! 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 Enter the Water Mia, which is a little on the nose with the name, people. If you want to be honest. Yay! But no seagulls, alas. Mm-hmm. Is there water there? <laughs> Son of a bitch. I shouldn't have been trying to be so super liminal, because they're right there. 
of young Luke. Who's young Luke? Oh, okay. <laughs> I love how they put us up there really to show that he's some fisherman. We just they stuck you in some fisherman's hut. Oh, cool. Well, thanks, Luke. May the force always be with you. All right, hey, Kara. Okay. No. Hmm, a good point. I can't believe I just said that to Kara. Oh. How uh, did you? Look behind the house, okay. Oh. Okie dokie? What kind of idea could that pot? I don't want to know, Neil, what broken ass invention you're gonna make. Okay, thanks, Luke. What, what's behind the house? Anything? I'm not seeing anything behind the house. What? Whoa! What? Of course. X month, X day. Dear God, Mega Man wrote this. Or X wrote this, I guess. Or Zero. Shut up, I don't really know much about the Mega Man series. Other than I just don't really enjoy it. Anyway, off topic. Oh no. Oh, well good. Nice. If you wish over a lotus leaf on a full moon night, your love will notice you. Hmm. Quick easy ways just to get buck naked in front of them. What? So is this, can I move around on these or something? No, doesn't look like it. They're just there, apparently. Okie dokie. Alright. Hi, what's this? Yeah! Alright. Sure. Ooh, check out the shirtless uh, circus over here. Mmm, bad news, buddy. We sunk that thing into the bottom of the ocean. He ain't finding Jack. Yeah. Oh, wait, didn't we find his, like, decrepit, destroyed body? Oh, no. Wait, wait. Two years ago... Would that, would that, would that, would that be, would that potentially be my daddy? If that could have been my daddy. Hmm, neat. Oh, well. We're busy exploring right now. What's this? Okay, so they make a pathway. Oh, check it out. Another shirtless circus. Okay. Well, that's not cool. That sounds like advice that probably won't come in handy at all, and I should wipe it from my memory banks. Neat. Hi. Uh... Your dad. Neat. You found your dad. What, this got ominous all of a sudden? Is this the crazy man? Oh. Oh, no. Does that run in the family? Okay. So what can I do? Ah, But I don't want to go to our room yet. I want to keep exploring. Okay, it's still daytime. I thought they were going to like... Is there anything like, a, is like another diary around here somewhere? Doesn't look like it. That's a shame. Oh well. Well, let's keep exploring. Hey, buddy. A sand fanger. Oh my. Hmm. Interesting. So, like, that means then I probably have to go get that to cure Lance's father because I'm not sure why I'd actually want to even do that, honestly. Hey, kiddo. Wait on the right side behind the gambling house. A lotus leaf will come. Neat. Good to know, buddy. Thanks. Okay. Yes, yes, we've met him. Turns out it's my friend from my childhood's father. Yeah, yeah, I could see how that could cause a problem. Now, where's the gambling house? Is this the gambling house? We like to move around. Ha cha cha cha. In high spirits, uncrushably high. Oh, that, I was kidding, but seriously? He's got the super plague. He's gonna die. He's got Captain Trips. He's done. You may as well just chuck him in the water right now and save yourself some time. Alright. So where's the damn gambling house, man? I don't know. Hey, buddy. A crook? Oh, well, neat. So that's the thing that says Kaya, Kaya, 
Like it's like Link or something in a 3D Zelda. Neat. Neat. Okay, a gambling house. Yeah, I'm coming right in. You, you just try and stop me. Okay. Okay, what? Well, yeah, Road to Ruin, people do that unconsciously, I betcha. They bet on who will win. Well, I'm, shoot, I can't really do much with a drinking contest. I'm just a kid. Oh, neat. Uh, give you red jewels. 27. Nice, we're getting close to that 30, which would be like the next level one. You can still do it. Mm-hmm. What's the big deal? Uh-huh. Okay. You can make a fortune. Oh. Oh, I just found a red jewel. <laughs> nice. Okay, well, it doesn't seem like I can do much in the scary uh, music noise place. Let's go back to pleasant music. Oh, what? It just went away. No. I did it. I did it, guys. I did it. Could you? Does it, does it, does it ever, does it go somewhere? So they just automatically go on their own, so it's just designed specifically around screwing me over, or what? What's out here, guy? Oh. They play Russian glass, so Russian roulette, basically. Wait, is that all there is? That God damn it. Well, that was annoying. <laughs> All right, uh, I guess we're done? We didn't do over here yet, did we? We drank this water cooler the way, yeah. Uh... Oh, good. Well, that's good to have a plan in life, I guess, but I'm gonna check all your pots for... Okay, I don't care. Get out of my face. I wanna steal from your pot. Yay, Red Jewel! Fantastical! You get nothing from me! All right, let's go into this place and see what's up. There's a dark space. Neat. <gasps> Apparently you can't walk in through the side of it. That's that's good to know. If it was under fire or something, that'd be a hell of a thing. Um, no, we want to record. We want to we wanna record, just to make sure we're feeling good. Uh, I'm going to look around town quickly, just to see if there's anything else I missed. And if not, we'll probably call that a video? Yeah, because I'm assuming the birthday party will be the next thing, and that'll probably lead us to our next, you know, real playing. So, un momento while I look around to find something else fancy we can do. Well, I can't say there's anything else to do, so maybe I will do that birthday thing real quick. Assuming that is what's next. Is this the house? This is not the house. I thought this was the AIDS house for a second. I was like, no, man, you keep that quilt away from me, all right? I have no desire. That's right, Luke was standing outside. Oh! Shoot, I just missed some of the conversation because this game is dumb. I remember my birthday? I remember when I was just a little sprout. Well, then why would she expect it if you kept... God damn it, Eric. Bring that. Bring that over here. <laughs> God. Wait, hold on a sec. You had that cake just jammed over there like in that drawer? <laughs> or it was on the... Either way, it was either in sight and she would have saw it, or it was in a drawer and it should be just crumpled and wrecked. <laughs> I somehow doubt that. Cake is easy, man. Bacon is the shiz. Oh, yes, you are, Marilyn. Her little birthday party. Okay. The end of the party. Okay. Wait, she, he was letting Eric totally bogart some beside her time? Jesus. What? Uh-oh. <laughs> oh my. He's making his move. Wait. Wait. 
You went with the flowers? I told you just to go date rape. Well, that's nice. Oh yeah. Okay. Then a tongue twister. Run away scared. Run away scared. Run away, run away, run away scared. Well, good. You just put yourself out there. That's a huge matzo ball on your face right there. And she is going to run away scared. <laughs> well, you blew it, buddy. Came on too strong. Who are you? Who are you, Ted Mosby? Dropping the L word on the first chat you get? Jesus. Mmm. You blew it, buddy. She planted herself in a field and you'll never see her again. <laughs> so Lance ran off too. Awesome. Yeah, I'd be worried too. <laughs> you know, two of her friends are missing, but I'm still going to talk about reading Kara's diary. Grow up, man. You have nothing to say either. Well, then what is the big deal? What's the gaff? I'll do that, Luke. I'll do that. I guess we'll wait till next time to figure out where Lance and Lily have run off to. Unless they're just out making mad, passionate love on a raft somewhere. In which case, you go, boy and girl, even if she's a plant. See you guys next time.